This is the Phoenix PD36 TAC. Let's get into it. Included in the box is this nylon pouch, USB-C cable, an extra O-ring, and the instruction manual. So here it is, this is the Phoenix PD36 TAC. Starting up front here, you can see your coated lens, and behind that is your LED, and this does use a luminous SST70, in case anyone's interested. It does have a bit of a strike bezel, but it's not super aggressive or pronounced, which I really like. Further down, you can see the markings here, and you can also notice there is no side switch. It's all operated from the rear tail cap. Going down further, you have the main body, which has some nice texture here. Not too aggressive, but it does work. And you do have a removable pocket clip. It's only a single position. There's no dual position on this one, but it still works and it's still removable. And then further back here, you can notice a little bit more texturing here, and then you have the main tail cap. And getting into that tail cap, you can see it is a three position tail cap with this movable little ring here. So your first position in the middle is the locking position, and that means that you cannot depress this button. The button is locked in. So that's a really cool safety feature to have. All the way to the left is the normal duty mode, and this cycles through all the different brightnesses. And then going all the way over to the right, you enter that tactical mode. And this is going to be a single brightness. It's between high and turbo, it's 2000 lumens. Another cool feature, if you depress it, and then you can put it in lock, you can actually lock the light on. So the lock not only works for when the light is off, but it also works for when the light is on. And taking off this tail cap, we can get to our battery. And it is a 5000 milliamp 21700. And this is fully rechargeable using this USB-C port on top. And this also has a charging indicator directly built into the positive terminal. You can see that little dot there? That's actually an LED. And it'll light up red when it's charging, and then the light will turn off when it is fully charged. So putting that in positive down, you can also see you have your waterproof seal here. And they do give you that extra one in the box, which I thought is a nice feature. And screwing in that tail cap. You're good to go. So let's go over how to use this flashlight. I'm going to start off here in duty mode, and this cycles through the five different modes. It's eco, low, medium, high, and turbo mode. So if you notice when we hit the button, it starts off in eco, and then let go and hit it again, into low, again for medium, again for high, and again for turbo. And then whenever you find the option that you want, you can click it in and it will stay on on that option. You can also just hold it for momentary on and then whenever you release the button, the light will turn off. In duty mode, you can also activate the flashlight with the constant on and then by tapping the tail switch, you can just cycle through all your various modes. And in this mode, as well as the other mode, if you hold down the button for a couple seconds, you'll enter strobe mode. And that strobe mode is super bright. It actually puts out an output of 2000 lumens in strobe mode. So that's super blinding there. All right, and going over to the right is your tactical mode. And this is a one brightness mode. So whatever you do constant on or momentary on, it's always going to be the same brightness and it's 2000 lumens. So it's between turbo and high mode. And you can also hold the switch down in this mode to enter strobe mode. Really super straightforward and nice and easy. So let's get into some of the specs of the light. That first mode, eco mode, is gonna be a brightness of 30 lumens and it'll run for 43 hours and 10 minutes. And then next up is that low mode that'll move it up to 150 lumens and run for 18 hours and 45 minutes. Bumping it up again to medium, that is 350 lumens and that'll run for 10 hours and 10 minutes. Again, high mode, that is 1000 lumens and that'll run for three hours and 15 minutes. And then bringing it up into turbo mode, that is that full 3000 lumens, and that'll run for one hour and 30 minutes. And that turbo mode also has a throw of 274 meters, so it throws it a very long ways. Tactical mode, only one option, and that is 2000 lumens. And that'll run for three hours and 10 minutes. And it also has a throw of 225 meters. Okay, this has a weight of 3.2 ounces, has a length of 5.5 inches, a head diameter of 1.04 inches, and a body diameter of exactly 1 inch. That also means that if you wanted to mount this to a rifle, you could use any 1 inch mount and it'll work fine. This also has a 1 meter impact rating as well as an IP68 waterproof and dustproof rating. So let's go ahead and take it out at night and see how it does. Alright, here we are with the PD36 at night. Go ahead and put it into eco mode. Yeah, even though that's only 30 lumens, it's still really usable. Going into low mode. All right, and there's low mode going into medium mode. All right, and there's the medium mode, 350 lumens. Let's go into high mode. All right, and there's high mode, that's 1,000 lumens. Let's go ahead and enter turbo mode. And there's that full 3,000 lumens. This thing is super bright, it's crazy bright. And you can see the beam shape is really nice. It's got a really good tight hotspot and nice even spill around it. All right, let's put it in tactical mode. 
Alright, and there's tactical mode, and that's 2,000 lumens. That's super, super bright. It's plenty bright for any normal situation. And I'm going to put it in the strobe mode for just a second. Alright, that's so blinding and disorienting. That's super bright. 2,000 lumens in strobe mode is crazy. And it flashes so fast. Getting into my final thoughts, I really like this light. It's super robust and durable. It's got that nice locking tail cap. And it's got some really insane output. And it's got plenty of different modes for any situation. So I will leave a link to this in the description if you're interested. You can go ahead and click that and that'll take you to the store to buy it. So anyway guys, if you like the video, be sure to hit like, subscribe if you want to see more videos like this. And thanks for watching. See you later.